moja ya madaraka katika kaunti ya Bungoma ya Kishika Kasi. Msemaji wa serikali Isaac Maura amethibitisha matairisho hayo yamekamilika na wakazi wa Bungoma wako radhi kuingia kwenye uwanja kushuhudia sherehe hizo akiwataka kufika kwa wingi ili kuweza kusikiza manufaa watakayopata kutoka kwa serikali ya mheshimiwa wa Rais William Ruto. Sandy Lugaria na taarifa hii kwa kina. We are fully prepared for the 61st Madaraka Day celebrations. Comprehensive strategies have been put in place to ensure the safety and security of all attendees, residents and visitors. Serikali imezindua msururu wa miradi katika kaunti nne za magharibi mwa Kenya kabla ya kuadhimisha siku kuu ya Madaraka Jumamosi. Agricultural projects such as the Lower Nzoia Irrigation Project with additional funding of over 3.2 billion shillings and the establishment of industrial parks across the country, the Kipes, aim to boost productivity and economic growth. Affordable housing projects in Kakamega and Vihiga counties uh, are going to cost approximately 1.6 billion and are already providing env uh, employment and our, our conducive uh, investment environment uh, for our people. Msemaji wa serikali daktari Isaac Mwaura alifichua kuwa sekta ya kilimo kwa jumla hasa kilimo cha miwa kinalenga kuimarika zaidi huku serikali ikiwekeza pakubwa katika sekta hiyo. The government has implemented several strategic interventions to support these economic activities. Efforts to revive the sugar industry include leasing public sugar mills, providing subsidized fertilizers and supporting legislative measures like the sugar bill number 34 of 2022 Miundo msingi pia imeorodheshwa kwa manufaa ikiwa ni pamoja na kuzinduliwa kwa uwanja mdogo wa ndege kituo cha pasporti na mabarabara katika kaunti ya Bungoma The government is also committed to enhancing infra infrastructure and social services in the region The completion of phase 1 of the Masinde Moliro project in Kandui sub county costing Kenya shillings 807 million and the, the habitation of the Matu law airstrip costing Kenya shillings 139 million for commercial flights are significant milestones Mwaura alichukua fursa hiyo kutetea ziara ya gharama kubwa ya rais William Ruto nchini Marekani ambaye alisema ilifadhiliwa na marafiki wa taifa la Kenya huku ikipelekea miradi yenye thamani ya zaidi ya shilingi trilioni moja inayotarajiwa kuzinduliwa Tell you it's minimal the cost of travel was subsidized by our friends but the benefits are much more than you could ever imagine more than a trillion shillings. The president's visit has led to several benefits and partnerships between the United States and Kenya. Kuhusiana na mafuriko, Mwaura nasema zaidi ya watu 1,292 bado wameathirika na kukosa makazi huku mvua ikitarajiwa kuendelea katika baadhi ya maeneo ya nchi. We are sad to report as of today that Kenya, uh, the people who have uh, lost their lives since March is the number stands at 315. That is 242 adults and 73 children. Stanley Lugaria, Look Up TV, Nairobi.